Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Daruk, and this is episode 10 of Resident Evil 2. So last we left off, we had kind of a backtracky episode. Uh, Claire kind of investigated a lot of the uh, police station, but we also encountered probably the most disgusting evil person just on an individual level that we've met in the Resident Evil games, uh, which was Chief Irons. And in our brief encounter with him, he essentially pistol whipped us and then kidnapped the girl <laughs> uh, who happened to be the daughter of the Birkins. So we're not really sure what the connection is and where everything like kind of lies plot wise. Uh, but we ended the episode with Sherry trying to steal the keys from Iron so she could escape the orphanage she's being confined in. Don't think it's going to go well, but we'll have to see how it goes. <laughs> at the end of the day. Um, and I also got a few comments just letting me know I missed some stuff. So I'm going to go double check and loop around and make sure I didn't miss anything. So thank you for letting me know. Um, and now without further ado, I hope you guys enjoy the episode and let's begin. All right, guys, it's going to get a bit hairy here, I think. So let's get started. Oh, God, that's creepy. I didn't even, I didn't even look the, around the corner. Is that an actual person? I think that actually is. That is so creepy. Yeah, this is gonna go well. Where you going, Sherry? I told you to stay put. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone. Just please. Time to teach She's going to throw that shit in his face. Let's go. Oh, God. It's like acid. You little bitch. You're going to pay for this. We got to get his keys, though, no? Oh. You hear Okay, guys. Oh, shit. Fuck. Go Run. Away! Yeah, okay. I don't think he's going away, Sherry. Oh, God. We gotta... Help! Hey. Somebody, please! Absolutely know where we have to go. We have to go... Bitch, that's a dead end. Okay. How do I... I need to hide. I need to freaking hide, kid. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh -huh. I'm about to get fucking destroyed. There's no way this is right. And he locked it. It's all over now. Doors locked. So I have to get the keys from him. Unlock the door. How the hell is that gonna work? Oh shit! Not the toy house. Show yourself. Oh god. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you. This kid's a freaking ninja. Do I have to get the keys from him? Okay, there's no way I'm getting them from him, though. Jesus. No, 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 bro. Go the other way. Oh, he's struggling. Shit. That was not the way to go. That was not the way to go. Get in the fridge, Sherry. <laughs> Get in the fridge. I see you. No, you don't. No, you don't, no! sir. You do not see me. You do not Game see over, me. Sherry. Game no! over, Sherry. No. You are trapped. All right. My bad, Sherry. I I don't know why I went towards the freaking fridge. I, I don't know. God, that's so fucking gross, dude. Oh, shit. Wrong. Wrong one. <laughs> fucking bulldoze him. Stupid bitch, that's 
All right, this guy. Gotta hide, gotta hide. All right, let's hope we don't mess it up like we did last time. When he goes back over there, I think we have to go through the door. Maybe. It's all over now. Doors locked. Gotta jump through the window, Sherry. Where are you? Show yourself. Bruh. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be. This is tense, dude. Alright, so we got away from the turn back and then we get through... Hit his toe God or something. Damn it. <laughs> Do we go through here? No. No way. No, don't see me, sir. Dude, I am I'm sweating bullets. I can't get through here either? What the fuck? What the fuck? What where do I go? Where the hell, where, where, what am I supposed to do? No! Well, I'm fucked. No shot. Oh. Oh. It burns. oh! He didn't see me. Holy shit, dude. Get the fucking key, Sherry. Get the fucking key. Can I lock him in? Fuck is my key. I see you. All right. I do not care if you see me. We are out of this bitch. Let's go. Let's go, Sherry. Oh, come on. Come on. Hurry. 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 You got to be able to go faster than that, Sherry. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. No shot! Alright, we're going back into the- Oh god, he's fucking sprinting. Can I lock the fucking door behind me or something? Yes, thank you. Oh, he's gonna fucking- Yeah, yeah, okay. I was gonna say, he's gonna fucking fire action. Like, he's gonna be like, here's Johnny moment. Jesus. Fucking Christ. I'm <laughs> this is the scariest part of the game so far. I'm fucking terrified. Sherry, though, is a fucking unit. Hit him with more acid. Oh, shit. Man, this dude's like a fucking Batman villain. Oh, my. What's the f fucking daddy's here, I guess. Oh, what the fuck? He... Oh my god, he fucking s slugged him? <laughs> He's got a fucking slug! Oh, now he- okay, so we got another fucking freak show in here. Love it. We're gonna fight- 30 minutes earlier. Okay. <laughs> Good to see you again, Claire. Alright. We've got unfinished business. Well, what oh, what's gonna happen Don't now? My fucking time. Oh my god. Bring me the pendant. Or Sherry dies. Oh, he needs the pendant. Pendant? What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll <laughs> find it. Okay, good good direction. Sherry, all right? For now. For I now. You bastard, if you hurt her. Yeah, he's gonna hang up. Are you serious? Damn it. Okay, so before you wait, asshole. I move on, 
I need to double check a few things. Someone said I missed a few things. Um, so let me just double check, check on that. I, I've just been like, this is kind of the, the intensity of the whole Sherry situation and everything kind of got me a little bit more like, um, uh, I don't say distracted, but like a little bit more faster paced. Cause I was like, oh man, like what's going on next? So I missed a few things. So I apologize. Um, so copy of emails to chief irons. Police Chief Irons, as thanks for your unwavering support, I have deposited a small sum in your account to use as you see fit. I hope I can count on you to maintain surveillance over your subordinates, especially the ones who survived that mansion. Get rid of them if you must. WB. Warner Brothers. <laughs> okay. I ran into some trouble with Umbrella Headquarters. The suits want to take the fruit of my research away, but don't worry, this will all blow over. Oh, it's... Birkins. Is, I, so is it William Birkin? Was that his first name? But don't worry, this will all blow over soon. You just keep doing what I tell you to, to do, tell you to, and everything will be all right. You're up to the security, you're to up, you are to up the security around my lab. Your muscle heads are to shoot any suspicious person on sight. Doesn't matter if they kill them or even if they're umbrella employees. I'm so close to completing G and no asshole is going to get in my way. Get your shit together and do your fucking job. I told you I need more security in the sewers. Don't you know how critical of a time this is for me? As for the money, I can pay you whatever once I take over, but not before. Why don't you get that? Never forget how expendable you are. Okay, so he's working with Birkin. So he was corrupt. Um, so thank you for letting me... I can't believe I missed that, but thank you for letting me know. Um, and then also, in his disturbing taxidermy log, uh, someone said the pig is not a pig. And that makes a little bit more sense. 28 year old female place of capture raccoon city. I always thought it was a bit weird because I, I, I kind of parsed that. I don't think I read it out loud, but I parsed it. It said raccoon city. I'm like, where are you getting a pig? But okay, this is code. That's really disturbing. This guy is a complete freak. Uh, so guys, love the comments. Thank you. Just let me know if I missed stuff or I don't understand something. Um, that's natural. Uh, and I, you're not going to hurt my feelings or I'm not going to be offended. Like, I don't mind it. No one's been really backseating or anything. So, um, it's been pretty good. Uh, so now I think we also, someone said, again, I keep saying someone, I, I, I should start writing the names down just so I can refer to you by name. Uh, but, um, that I also missed some stuff in the parking garage. So let me just run back there real quick and check it out, see what I missed. Um, so, cause I don't think I did, I, I definitely missed a few things cause I was running from the liquors for, for my life. So let's do that. Um, and then we'll get back to, we'll get back to whatever we need to do. Yeah, so this was the key, right? The beeper. Yeah, okay, cool. So that's good. Um, I don't... I can just use this key here just to use it so I can get rid of it, I think, because that's the last thing here. Yep, this card. Um, there might be some ammo in here or something. Oh, that's actually pretty good. That's good. Oh, and then this is, I think, the hidden compartments in the, um, in the police station. So I should probably do that. And I don't care enough to get that, <laughs> that fire stuff right now. Um, so let's get out of here. Mr. Licker. All right, cool. So let's develop that film. And if it's that extra or it's one of the lockers, I don't remember. It might be just the lockers. Either way, we can just get some last second loot before we head out to the orphanage. Because I assume that's going to be our essentially underground laboratory or sewer section. Maybe we can come back here from the orphanage. I'm not sure. We'll see. Because I actually wonder if they're going to make us do the underground lab. Again, I, I am a little bit confused on how they're going to, like, what we're supposed to, Oh, my God. And I fucking left the parking. 
Guys, I'm so busy squawking, just talking my ass off that I forget to do the things that I'm supposed to be doing. Examine, beep it, let's go. Wait, another pistol? What the hell? Okay, dude, they're, they're just giving you so many guns. I've got a pistol. I've got three pistols, a grenade launcher, and an Uzi. Um, all right. Now, I think, so I mean, pretty much, there is some high-grade gunpowder here, and there's some flame rounds here. Uh, I don't... I mean, uh, I'm trying to debate if, I mean, I should get them, but I'm, I'm lazy. I don't know what to tell you guys. <laughs> Uh, I will definitely not regret it later. I will not. Okay, so this looks pretty cool. What is this? 9mm handgun, 13 shot. Okay, and I know I have, I think I have an equipment for it actually. I think I have a component for it. It's got a laser sight too. That's pretty cool. So does that, what... It uses 9mm as well. Yeah, so both of these use 9mm. This is just like the better version, I guess. And then I've got a high capacity mag, which I won't use. Well, actually, I should hold on to because it will give me ammo, I believe. <laughs> um, all right, so... So let's finish up here then. Let's get that last, um, some of the last stuff we can get and then we'll get out of here and go to the orphanage. I forgot about that guys. Oh my fucking God. Uh, my heart can't take it. Ow, that, that was actually painful physically for me. I wish I was a more reactive person, like I could scream or something. That'd be more entertaining maybe, but I... That was about... That was like me actually terrified, and I don't think I actually reacted besides going... <laughs> oh, man. Alright, guys, let's get going. Got uh, the submachine gun ammo, which was well worth it for that backtracking. It was like a hundred bullets, so... Oh! I didn't even hear him! Fuck! Okay, he's about to fucking clock me. Okay, he missed. Dude, where the hell did you come from, man? I wasn't even paying- I'm too busy trying to fucking talk to my viewers. I, I can't- I can't concentrate on this. Oh, hello. Oh, is that a zombie? <laughs> Love how just funny he walks. <laughs> Once you just look at him. Hey, what's up, guys? Gun shop. It's time to go to. Looks like it's the other way. Oh, dodge. So we're not going through there. Thank you, guys. See, this is something I wish I want to see more of. Is like what the city is like. I think it'd be cool. Like I wonder if the original RE2, like, you spent more time in the actual city. Because it, it feels like that's, like, like a really good setting. So I'm surprised it was just, like, we're just perpetually, like, inside. Like, look at this. Like, wouldn't it be cool? Like, see, so you see the dogs? How cool is this? I mean, we're definitely having a run through here, but an entire game like this would be pretty awesome, I think. Please don't lunge at me. Oh, I shouldn't notice me. Oh, not the dogs. I can't tell if I'm killing it or if the animation's bugging out. That's funny. All right, so that's one dead one. All right. But yeah, see, uh, this is really cool. I like this part so far. 
nothing here. There's an herb here. Oh, there's more dogs. Oh, and some ammo. Unfortunately, I don't have my SMG with me. Not good. Oh shit! Dude, these guys are perfectly synchronized. <laughs> I'm hoping this reloads my gun, because if it doesn't, it- Okay, it reloaded it. I was counting on that, because if it did not reload, it was going to be really bad. <laughs> oh, there's another one? Okay, we're we're running low on ammo. Hey! That's not fair. Where the hell did you go? Oh. Alright, well, this is bad. Um... Hmm... Just hopefully some ammo in this area. Okay, that's good. Don't mind some of the red stuff too. What? Where am I going? Oh, probably in that building? No? Okay. Am I blind? I might be. Or maybe in the bus or something? That makes sense. Yes. Oh boy. We don't have a lot of ammo left. Do have a grenade though. Oh, the dogs though. Well, shit. Do I... Ay, ay, ay. Get the freaking the raccoon! Before the dogs get to me. Thank you. Thank you. Good job, Claire. Hang on, Sherry. I swear Claire's route feels so much more... Like... She's more pursued. Maybe it's because I had worse luck with Mr. X or... But like the amount of like liquors and X and like these sequences with the dogs and everything, it feels like you're a lot more on like the um on the run. Wow, there's just there's literal gravestones just out in front of the orphanage. That is really dark. Imagine you go to an orphanage, you're like, okay, I'm gonna get adopted, I hope. And then just like there's just tombstones. There's like, yep, these are all the kids that died. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> oh man, that's messed up. All right, there's got to be a safe room. Hello, I have the pendant. Yeah, that dude's gonna be full of G, the good stuff. That's what G is short for. Um, and he is. Yeah, okay. He's gonna look. Oh, he does not look. He doesn't look that messed up. Oh, he's gonna puke out slugs? Yeah, get away from him. Oh, ew. Okay. Whoa, is that? That's like a fucking alien reference or something? I've literally never seen the movie, but I do know the, the little baby aliens come out of the dude's chest. So he got like freaking... He got like slugged in the mouth. And then... A chest burster came out. Weird. <laughs> Someone's are if you're reaping this, go call Colise. Boogeyman's here eating every bobby. <laughs> eating every bobby. Many bark boogeyman's here. Helk, they're coming. Helk me mommy. That's dark, but the way it was written was kind of funny. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm fucked up, I guess. Damn. So, was this the pig? I think that was the pig. So, where is Sherry? Oh, okay, there's just a freaking underground tunnel, too. Another secret tunnel. Uh, some more taxidermy shit. No, 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 no. Hold up. Can I explore the rest of the mansion, or is it worth it? Oh, there's, see, there's something in the bathroom. No, Claire, Claire, lady, come on. 
Come on. Okay. Okay, Jesus. Let's go to the bathroom and see what's up. Sucks to suck, bro. Honestly, a better death than you deserved. You should have gotten eaten alive by those thingies. Oh, and god damn it. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. Uh, I might have to though, we'll see. First aid, okay. Eh. Letter from the director, just in the bathroom, okay. Regarding the incident in question, I'm glad to report that it has all been taken care of. On February 19th, test subject 628 escaped from the lab and broke into our facility. 628 was originally from this facility's candidate pool and apparently returned in the hope of seeking help. 628 was quickly detained by our staff. So that was Oscar? I remember one of the kids said as uh, someone came back. As 628 was undergoing one of the lab's clinical trials, there was a distinct possibility they had brought the virus with them, so we disposed of all of our test subject candidates as a precaution. Their speedy disposal was conducted by the security team, to whom I'd like to extend my thanks. Jesus. As for our neighbors, we told them that due to the building's dilapidated state, we have temporarily moved all the children to a different orphanage. As to the future of this facility, once it has been fully decontaminated, I plan to resume securing more test candidates. Jesus fucking Christ. This is, like, so fucked up. Like, I didn't think the game would get, like, this, this disturbing in terms of, like, I, I, we're not visually really seeing it, we're just hearing about it, but, like, that's still, like, pretty crazy that they're, like, they're literally killing, they're testing on kids and then legit just straight up executing them. That's, like, really fucked up. Well, I don't have any bullets. And that raccoon is... <laughs> Bro, I, I I can't. I can't use a flame round on the raccoon. It's just illegal. You know, like, because in the first game, it was all kind of, like, campy. And, like, oh, we've created the ultimate bioweapon. But, like, you know, turning people into zombies is, like... You know, it's messed up. Human experimentation. But it's, like, not, like, that messed up, you know? What? Are those octopus tentacles? That's what it looks like. Or starfish. I don't know. Stars for starfish. Sherry, yeah, you? I am not yelling that out after I just saw some dude get like a freaking chest Hold burster right pop out. When, where the hell is Birkin? And I got no ammo? Fuck my life. I, Dude, bro, really? Oh, what is your problem? Claire, yeah, okay, you girl, stop. you can go faster. Hurry. Keep going. Sir. When is fucking Birkin gonna come and save the day? Just fucking hit him. Come on, get in, get in. Oh, his eyes are intense. Oh, there we go. There we go. Let's go! Oh god, the head's coming out. <laughs> oh! So, yeah, that's bad. Well, things seem to be going well. <laughs> Bruh, Birkin, you have just, you're a busy man. Wake up. Open your eyes. Oh, what the fuck? I'm not infected. What the? I guess he's gone. Sherry. 
Where's Sherry? Sherry. Sherry's fine. Do you know Sherry? It's an impressive display of strength. What happened to her? We have to assess the situation. Who are you? I'm Claire. I didn't foresee this. Excuse me. <laughs> what is this dialogue? Where is she? Oh, look at me being a scientist. I'm so Help. scientific. <laughs> Gosh. Annette. Annette. Me, what happened to William? William Birkin. Oh, a little bastard. Big bastard. Can you help me find Sherry? Seems to be evolving much faster than expected. Where are you going? Look, I don't have time to play 20 questions. Everything's under control. Yeah, it looks good. I need to find Sherry. My looks daughter is not your concern. Looks under control. <laughs> Slams the door in our face. Ch like, that was a weird, that was a weird scene. She's like kind of... Where did Sherry go? Um, all right, so Sherry's her daughter. She's gone. She disappeared. Left an ink ribbon for me. Report about G. The G virus clinical trial will be entering its final phase very soon. Before G, the new creature that will surpass humans is born. Allow me to predict a few things about its biology and biological function. So we don't even know. <laughs> We're like, this is the thing that's gonna... We haven't done any testing on this. You know, we, we've got our... We haven't we haven't actually turned a human into anything with G. Uh, but this is what's gonna surpass humans. Intelligence. The subject's intelligence will begin to drop immediately. With their linguistic abilities disappearing within a matter of days. They will lose their capacity to reason and their humanity. Chi will be a creature of pure instinct driven only by need to survive and reproduce. Surpass humanity. <laughs> There's nothing but fuck and eat and shit. <laughs> Has no reason or humanity. Amazing. Due to its unusually accelerated cell division, evolution... Not really. <laughs> it will be highly adaptable to any environment. Furthermore, with its amazing ability to repair itself through regeneration, it will be extremely difficult to completely kill it with any conventional small firepower. Yeah, you know, its little heads will come out, it'll get claws. That's evolution. Um, reproductive behavior. G's most remarkable feature will be its intense desire to reproduce. So... <laughs> That's what the fucking slug thing was. It will instinctively search out humans with DNA that closely match its own and implant an embryo in them. Why would it search for something with the closest DNA match if it's trying to reproduce? I think I'm reading a little bit too far into it, sorry. But the chances of success are very low, and if the DNA is not a close enough of a match, an underdeveloped G creature will be produced instead. Okay. I suppose the only ones who might be a close enough of a match would be any bio biological children of the subject, though. Man, okay, this game got so dark and gross and twisted and weird. So we went from having like, okay, we've got some bio weapon that's going to turn people into into giant you know to to zombies i'll eat people you know it's a bio weapon we're just here it's fucking scorched earth kind of makes sense right now we've got we're sur we got the ultimate life form we're surpassing humanity has no critical thinking skills can't do anything but just wants to fuck but the only thing it wants to reproduce with are its own biological children that the human made what what who who's writing this again like this the more I write, the more this makes sense, man. We've, we've done a good thing here. That's so insane. Um, all right. Well, that's 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 the nature of the story. Uh, it's fucking whack. Um, all right. Let's let's save. Did William Birkin, the chief, all these guys are just fucking freaks. Holy cow. Um, all right, so we got no ammo. We got this, but what we do have is quite a bit of submachine gun ammo. 
I think we might have to um, let ourselves indulge a little bit in some <laughs> in some more Call of Duty level gameplay with <laughs> this fucking decked out SMG. No, oh, well, she locked that. All right, so hopefully, so Birkin is going to look to put a slug in his daughter. Yep, that's, Sherry? the writers wrote that down Sherry? and said, this is gold. <laughs> this is gold. <laughs> We're game of the year. <laughs> game of the year. <laughs> uh, I've, I've, I've taken the piss uh, out of the writing a little bit too much. I, I'm still, <laughs> now, I'm gonna smell shit. literally. Yeah. Okay, so we actually do even have, a, okay, I thought we'd spend more time in the orphanage, but I guess there's not much to do there. Uh, can't wait for those giant fucking things to come out of the sewers. The impossible to kill things. Or are we just gonna go straight to the lab? Please tell me go straight to the lab. I, I do not want to do the sewers. Never again. Don't do me like this. I wonder if we'll ever run into Ada as Claire, or if that's just not a thing. Oh, shit. This is so fun. Okay, I like this. Even if it doesn't really have any impact, but it's fun. <laughs> that's fucking cool. I do think I... I prefer, I prefer the shotgun to the grenade launcher, but I do quite like this. Um, and I prefer the like the cowboy pistol to the to Leon's pistol. Copy of emails. I think we've already seen this. We're trapped. Yeah, Ness has been contaminated. You, Zol, you. But so again, that's where, from my understanding, Birkin wanted. I, I, I can't quite remember why he hated Umbrella so much. Something something happened. He was not happy. Okay, bro. You asshole. Stay down, bro. Okay. Um. Sorry, I'm just trying to remember exactly what happened. I think we are gonna have to do this fucking sewer bit of. But oh god. Um. I don't remember why he hated them. I I think they they fucked him over or something. Hold up. What is this? Sherry, I told you I cannot leave huh? here until my work is done. That's what you always say. Sherry? Why didn't you stay in the house? It was safe. Why did she put him put her in the fucking Sherry trash compactor? I, I was scared. Those things were everywhere and you should have called the police. The, the Burk yeah okay the police what are the police gonna do lady what, have you seen looked outside have you looked outside okay the Birkins are the worst I can't dude they're they're literally the worst people on the planet <laughs> like Sherry Sherry I'm coming oh and now she's sick god damn it bro oh my god yeah the birkins are just the fucking worst it's unbelievable oh i got another save point um oh god okay so whatever reason i can't remember why birkin hates umbrella he's working on g says he's gonna sell it to the u.s government they find out they send in a team to stop him he gets shot, but he, he has some G left, like, or that he hid. He takes it. He goes fucking bonkers, kills the fucking, the, the security team, and then the rats get it, and that infects the city, and that's where this outbreak came from. So why are they blaming the director? That's where I'm a bit confused. Um, so we got to do with this shit. Yep, okay. Well, this is going to be a while. I thought we were done with these sewers. They brought me back in just when I thought I was out. Uh, all right, well, we'll have to do some exploring here. Can't wait to lose my mind in here. Uh, 
And yeah, like, Annette is, like, kind of just... Before, she was all, like, in Leon's route. She was all like, oh, we have to stop him. He can't get out. But, but in this route, she's, like, trying to find out as much as possible. Like, it's a bit interesting. Sir? <laughs> I heard, I heard. <laughs> What the hell is up with you? 212A. Okay, so that's for something else. Okay. Yeah, this is the worst part of the game. I hate these big things. Is the SMG actually a good weapon for like anything besides just being fun? I'm curious. Maybe it's good against bosses. I think I said that before, but I feel like the only boss where that really matter, maybe the maybe Birkin. So this is where we yeah. Oh my lord. Where do I need to go? Okay, we're gonna go through here, I guess. As long as I don't have to deal with these giant slug monsters or sewer monsters, I don't mind as much. Wait, what am I? This is a complete backtrack. What am I doing? Well, where the hell am I going then? <laughs> All right, I'm lost. Where did this lead to again? Was this where the flamethrower was? Oh God, no, this was the fucking doom hallway. Waterway, sewerway. It was fucked at the end of the day. Are we equipped to go through here? It's fucking disgusting is what it is. And we another one of these fucking tiny ass things. So were those... I actually think... Man, I can't remember. You guys... Uh, uh, there's so much going on. Um, but I actually think, again... In the comments, someone said that those sewer, these sewer monsters were like G, were like lesser G, mu like, you know, like, whatever was in the fucking comment. Ah, uh, sorry, I'm, oh, what the fuck? That's troll. Okay, no, 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 no. Sorry, I'm stumbling over my words. I guess I'll pick it up, but probably not the best idea. Oh shit. Yeah, I got another grenade. Just just eat the grenade. Eat the grenade. And there's a third one coming out. And there's a zombie. No way, bro. These things are so broken. I can't, man. I'm fucking dead, too. I am so fucked. Oh, maybe not. Okay. Well, that won't work. Um, alright. So what I was trying to fucking say before the goddamn swarm was on me. Was that I think someone mentioned that they were G mutants so i think someone said that if an underdeveloped g creature so that might be what those things are because they're kind of like birkin-esque right like they've got the fucking eyeball so that's probably what that is and then like a like a real g creature 
I don't really know what a real G creature is supposed to look like. Just whatever fucking Birkin is. Just a giant fucking bone claw eye monster thing that just fucks shit up. Because that's, I guess, the only thing it is. I don't know. Um, but, yeah. That's the vibe I'm getting here. Um, Alright, how the hell... What am I supposed to do? Okay, well, we can maybe, through some act of God, make it back through there, but I need... How did I get through here the first time? Did I need to take a, a fucking thing with me? Is that what that was? Oh, no, this is open. I'm trolling. Okay, thank God. I'm gonna be so sad. Alright, let's pick up whatever the hell this thing is. This looks fucking like some goddamn sci-fi gun. The Umbrella Spark Shot. This gun fires wired metal prongs into your target, allowing you to fry them with electricity for as long as you have the weapon raised. So this is like a super taser. For use on test animals. Interesting. Stay down, boys. Stay down. Whoops. I was gonna just put this here, but I think I've got everything in here, right? Oh. No? Oh, I could have just used the door. <laughs> uh, I actually do think I've got all the items, so... Feel free to yell at me when I have inevitably missed something. Alright, now the challenge is going to be getting back across through that fucking hellhole. But we got, got what we needed. Man, those things do not make good sound. So we've got one healing item. We've got no grenades, but we've got this spark shot shit. So let's give it a go. Let's see if we can make a run for it. Honestly, it's going well. It's going well. Not going well. Wait, did that fucking kill it? Holy shit. Okay. God damn. Oh no, no, no. What the fuck? Get in there and don't come back out. All right, we're good. Oh, clean, 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 guys. I'm actually like a pro gamer. Okay, not too bad. Alright, well, we gotta be careful with this thing's shots, because that thing seems fucking insanely good, but not a lot of ammo. Alright. So now where am I going? <laughs> um, I kind of want to see if I can finish up this sewer bit in one setting, so I don't have to fucking go through this shit again. I think then we can end it right before the fucking most awful boss fight ever. <laughs> Where I, I try not to cry as Birkin tries to... Like, I have to hit Birkin with a freaking um... Cargo container. Yes, yes. No way that hit me. Okay. Use, we're good. We're good. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, and we can get back to the police station from here as well. Yeah. Okay, so I guess I thought we wouldn't be going through the sewers again. I thought that whole city section, the orphanage thing, I got pretty excited for that part of the game, and then it turns out that's not what we're doing. Okay, this is problematic. I don't actually have a lot of ammo here. Was this where Leon came in from? I think it might have been. It's everything here though. Okay, this is bad. I guess I have to use this. But I think it only does one guy at a time. It feels really bad to use it on a normal zombie, but I actually don't think I can make it through here. Can I... Alright, this is not good. Because it doesn't kill them either. So I'm just toasting these guys for nothing. Fuck. I, they even have an animation for two dudes. That's kind of insane. Thank God that guy's laundry missed. If I died, I was not doing the rest of that. Yo, I used so much ammo. I'm sure it was worth it. I should have just gone down. I could have probably run them in a circle if I actually just went into the water. But what can you do? And this is the way back to the thingy. Right? Yeah. The police station. Then SZF for that area. Alright, let's do one final loop de loo in the uh, police department to get some gear from the hidden places, locations, and then we'll get back to the sewers. Alright, so we've pretty much got everything. There's uh, some records. So, sorry, there's some ink ribbons in the record room, and then, you know, the parts in the parking garage, which was some high grade gunpowder, and then two flame rounds, I think. So I haven't gotten everything, but for the most part, we got everything. We got our extended magazine for our SMG, which is pretty cool. Um, now let's just finish out these sewers. And then we can uh, kind of get to saving Sherry. I think I preferred Ada. I, <laughs> I think I preferred Ada a lot and more <laughs> to Sherry. Uh, but that one sequence, I will say, I will say actually, the Sherry sequence with like trying to run away from Chief Irons was way more interesting than like those short hacking segment where we played Ada. That was, that was kind of whatever. Um, so there was that. God damn it. Here's the special forces, guys. So this will be the video cassette, yeah. Nope, 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 nope. I shall leave you alone, sir, to enjoy yourself there. Oh, 
I'm gonna have to get down there at some point though, but for now. God, there's so fucking many. So I think these are like magnum rounds effectively. Oh no. Yeah, okay. Fuck it. I know so many of you guys like cringed so hard when you saw me use the needle cartridge and stuff on those guys, but what can you do? What can you do? Um, what does that even do? Oh, I think I just need this part for the, um... So I actually think I might need to... Wait. Hold up. No, I think I can actually just do that fine. I think we're good. Yeah, the only problem here is I need to... Actually, maybe not. I think... No, there, there isn't anything else here. Was there an item here? I could have sworn there was, but I think I'm being dumb. Okay, so we gotta get through one of these slime boys. Okay, he's just there. Now I can do the puzzle and then I think we're good. Alright, let me do this puzzle. And then, there's no way I'm doing the boss fight right now. Um, but, that kind of gives us a good stopping point. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I forgot I needed the queen and king. How did I forget that, dude? Oh. All right. I fucked up. I fucked up. I can't believe I forgot. I was like, why do they have to be there? Why, why would I? The point is there's like a small little puzzle so you can take them both out. That's the point. All right. Let's watch Operation Nest Wrecker because they got this shit on VHS tape for us. It's very nice of them. Oh, please stop. He's just eating that shit. Yum, yum, yum. Damn. Yeah, and then the rats got it and it spread into the city. Got it. Alright, I actually... I, watch that. <laughs> I don't think I have the mental fortitude to go back through there. But sometimes you gotta persevere, guys. Sometimes you gotta just wade through shit and zombie monsters because you fucking forgot to take the goddamn chess pieces that you knew you needed. Sometimes you do that. It's normal, right? Oh. That's a tilter. <laughs> All right, let's let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm going to I said I was going to wrap up this sewer section in one bit, so that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. Okay, guys. We got everything we needed. I didn't to solve this puzzle real quick. The rook's next to the knight, but not facing the queen. So the knight is here, right? That is the knight. 
So that's where the rook is, but not facing the queen. The king ain't next to the queen, but is facing the knight. And the knight ain't where the case marking says. Okay, so that's a bit confusing. Um, the pawn should be though, right? So the pawn's here. So we take the bishop, we put the king here. Nice. Okay, cool. Yeah, guys, I think we're going to wrap it up here. Uh, and we'll save next the boss fight for next episode where we have to fight uh, William Birkin again and try to hit him with the cargo container. We'll see how much is left to play. I don't know how much of the underground lab we have to do if we're doing all of it. Um, if things change for Claire's route, like some things have changed. Uh, so thank you for joining me on this episode. I apologize for the... <laughs> The chess piece situation that was insane uh, and if I missed anything or I kind of made some bad I formulated my thoughts and maybe came to the wrong conclusion again if it's not spoilery feel free to let me know uh, I enjoy hearing uh, your guys' opinions and thoughts so uh, thanks again and I'll see you guys again soon